We continue our team coverage with Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Reed. She joins us with what today's installation means to Philadelphia's Catholic community. Alicia. That's right. There was no question about the energy and excitement of having a new archbishop. There was a celebration inside and there was a celebration outside. <laughs> Outside the new Archbishop's installation, families welcomed him in song. Particularly excited to be here, Maria Marullo, who was blessed by Archbishop Nelson Perez before she and her husband conceived their seven children. We are very, very uh, excited because we have the blessing of uh, have received our, our marriage blessing from Bishop uh, Nelson back then, you know, Monsignor Nelson. Thousands packed the Basilica of Saints Peter and Paul Cathedral to take part in the installation mass, especially after meeting him years ago. The, um, the first time he came to the Milagrosa Church on uh, 19 Spring Garden for 1989. Archbishop Nelson Perez was raised in New Jersey and was the leader of three churches in the area. He's bilingual, and as the region celebrates his homecoming, they're hoping he'll unify the church. I hope he leads the church into a new direction and bring back more young people to the church and just open up the church to everyone. There was one minor disruption during the mass. A man that calls himself Philly Jesus was told to leave after walking up to the speakers. After refusing, police physically removed him and wrote him a citation. We were the only TV station there. They took my feet, they grabbed my ankles, and then they grabbed my hands and like like military style like like i was some like uh like i was some like type of terrorist or something you know like it's horrible i i was so embarrassed and i was so like heartbroken because I, all i do is sit in front of the blessed sacrament Aside from that one hiccup, this was quite the homecoming. Thousands of people were able to pray with and welcome the new Archbishop. Reporting live from Logan Square, Alicia Reed, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Alicia, thank you. Well, we stream today's entire installation on CBS and Philly, and if you missed it, you can rewatch the ceremony on our website, cbsphilly.com.